Hello, I'm Jonathan, my pronouns are he, him, and this is my guide to getting the most out of your first few weeks at uni. So, as I discuss starting university, I would like to provide some background that I was one of the first members of my family to go to uni, so I'm familiar with the feeling of going into the unknown and will hopefully try to alleviate any stresses through this video. Meeting your flatmates can be very nerving, as living with people you haven't met before is a strange experience. But the key on the first day is to act respectful, introduce yourself, and overall just learn who you're living with. So when you get there, obviously there's going to be questions about how stuff is organised, especially in your kitchen. And it's good to decide who gets what spaces, what cupboards, what drawers, stuff like that, just so you're all on the same page quickly. It's also great just to see who your flatmates are as people. For example, when I first moved into my flat, on the first night we played some Uno together. I mean, it's a simple card game and it's not doing much, but it was a great way of just learning who everyone was and starting to get to know their personalities a little bit. On your first day, you should also be visited by a stick as well, being a second third year contact. This second or third year should be able to guide you to any events on your freshers timetable and answer any questions which you've got. There may be an event on your very first night at uni. And if there is, I can recommend going down there with your flat. It can be a great chance to get to know everyone better. My first event, which was on night one, was Dress as Your Degree, which I participated in, even despite being a non-drinker, and just decided to have fun with. Moving on to the rest of Freshers Week, I'd advise really looking at the Freshers timetable, getting to know what events are on, and what events you'll be interested in. Now there's a lot of events there and you don't have to turn up to all of them, but I'd definitely recommend giving quite a few a try. And if you're concerned about going to these events alone, you can go with your flatmates. And if that doesn't work, use the Freshers Facebook group or WhatsApp groups or anything to find other students who will also be going to the event. When I went to the comedy night, my flatmates weren't going, but I managed to meet with this group of people from a WhatsApp group and the whole lot of us went down together and it made it better for finding our way there and having someone I guess to talk to or people to talk to. One event which you will likely have as well is one called Access All Areas. Now this is one where all of the bars on campus open up and you sort of tour around them. As a drinker or non-drinker, I think it's still great to go as you can use this event to get to know where things are. Also to help you with finding places, there's the My University of York app which actually has a map feature inside of it. Moving on to the end of the week, there's the Freshers' Fair. Now this is an event where you can really look around, see what societies the uni has to offer, see what sports they have to offer. When it came to my Freshers' Fair, I wrote a list of societies I wanted to visit on the day, and then looked up the maps which they provided to find out where these stalls were. That allowed me to get around the Freshers' Fair quite nicely, visit the people I wanted to visit, and overall really get an idea of what the university had to offer and what sort of societies I'd really like to attend. Don't be afraid though to go out of your comfort zone and look at some societies which you may be unsure about because from my experience all of the societies are very welcoming to newcomers and it's just a great way to meet other students. Overall I'd just say make sure to take the opportunities that you are given. Anyway that's it for my quick guide to getting the most out of your first few weeks at uni. I wish you luck in your first week and really enjoy yourself. Bye.